Hey guys, Mama Vindy here. Welcome to my channel. This is going to be another quick grocery haul of everything that we picked up today from Sam's Club and the Commissary. Okay, we just got back a few minutes ago. Um, earlier, we went to Sam's. I kind of just put the cold stuff in the fridge until we could run to the Commissary, which is usually where we get our meats and butter and stuff. Well, they were actually out of the butter and everything today, so I don't know what was going on there, but they were out of a ton of stuff. I can't do a ton of meats and everything if you guys are new to my channel. Um, because we only have one small freezer. I think that's about to change because I'm about to go bust it out and buy us a freezer. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we can knock that out tomorrow. And I'm going to go ahead and jump right in and show you guys the things that we picked up. We picked up some paper towels, some toilet tissue, some paper plates, some foil containers, both large and smaller ones because we grill a lot. We also have some spoons and some plastic cups, some Reynolds Wrap two-pack there. We have our 12 gallons of milk. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, we're a large family of 10. I usually go through about a gallon of milk a day. So we pick up 12 when we do a grocery haul and I pick up also another 12 um, midway through the month. So there's our milk there. We have some Go-Gurt two packs there that have 32 each in the strawberry and berry flavors. We have some whipped cream back here in the Ready Whip three pack from Sam's. Some heavy cream and half and half, some jalapeno artichoke dip. The cheese we picked up from the commissary. They didn't have the one I usually get, so I only picked up four of these Sargento sharp cheddar Finally, shredded ones for now. We also got some of this Lando Lake soft squeeze spread. My husband got that since we didn't, we weren't able to get our butter because they didn't have any of the butter. So we'll have to pick that up next time. Um, I got another pack of this strain cheese, the Sargento for the kids. And we also picked up two of these grapes here. They looked pretty good. We got some strawberries. They look so-so. And then we also picked up some blueberries, two packs of those, because all the little ones love those. We also got two bags of apples, the Ambrosia Gold four-pound bag there, and the Honeycrisp apples. We also picked up some broccoli. There's some avocados. There's some spinach, some of the organic baby spinach there. There's a pack of tomatoes on the vine down here. That's a good pack there. We've been doing some BLTs, so those are good. And then we got some onions back over here, some green peppers, some sweet peppers. We have two bags of potatoes because we're out of those. And I believe I picked up 14 packs of this bacon, the hickory smoked bacon. I picked this one up because I think it's the cheapest one that I see over at the commissary. So I think it's like two sixty. dollars So I always stock up on that one and we've eaten a lot of bacon around here lately, especially because I'm trying to eat healthier and do gluten-free around here. So we also have some of this maple syrup um, sausage, Vermont sausage here, two packs of those. And then there's two packs of the brown sugar and honey Johnson Girl sausages there. It looks like we have two, four, six of these uh, cube steaks, um, two packs. And then there's only two packs of the hamburger meat. There's a pack of the ground beef and pork, um, I believe for meatballs. We have four packs of this Contessa uncooked um, shrimp. It's been peeled and deveined there. We have two packs of ribs, and we also have, we don't usually get the Tyson one, we just get whichever one is the cheapest, but they didn't have any chicken this time, the chicken tenderloins that I like to use in a lot of recipes, so we just picked up a couple for now, and hopefully when I get the freezer, I'll just stock up on that stuff. So over here we have some hard salami, there's like, looks like a pound of that, and then my husband likes this peppered salami there. He just got a little bit of that. He likes to snack on. And then we got two packs of these hot dogs, 24 count hot dogs there. 
and I wanted to try this one. This is a Robert Irvin. I have never seen this in the stores at least, but he has this um, bacon wrapped stuff, uncooked chicken with asparagus and pepper jack. That looks pretty good. We wanted to try it. Just curious, see if it's any good. And then also his um, bacon wrapped stuffed uncooked chicken, jalapeno, and cream cheese. I mean, those look kind of good. You can see those. It says they're high in protein, individually wrapped, and uh, you cook it from frozen. So, and it says great for the grill, so we might try that too. So, that'll be interesting. And then I also saw these um, smoked sausages. They didn't have any of the regular one that I pick up, so I thought, oh, we could try these. Maybe they'll be good. I don't know, we'll see. They only had three of the broccoli that I usually get that are frozen, and the green giant, I really like these. The other ones that we've tried have way too much water in them when we cook them in the microwave, so I don't like them. I like these, and they're pretty cheap on the base, so. We also got the kids some of these fish sticks here for easy meals, there's a 90, 90 sticks in there, and then like four of these little tombstone pizzas, pepperoni. Also, some of these little pizza rolls, just like a small pack, because like I said, I don't have a lot of room in the freezer. Hoping to change that soon. And then we got some lumpia wrap for the lumpia, you know, that my husband likes to make. And then also, let's see, we got some uh, pretzel sticks, as far as like the chips and stuff go. My husband got some of these pork skins over here, the Sweet Southern Heat Barbecue. Looks like two bags. Also, we got some spicy jalapeno Fritos. My husband got those also. And then I think he's getting some of these salt and vinegar ones as well. There's two packs of these Hawaiian bread rolls over here. Those are like double packs, so there's like four in there. And then two of the twin packs of the classic white bread. And then we got two packs of the Frito regulars because we do Frito pie. I think there is like 13 of these kimchi noodle bowls because the kids like to have those for quick lunches. I don't remember even getting these so maybe my husband picked these up. These are the chocolate veg brownie mix and the Pillsbury. We got a pack of the Yoohoo's because my little ones like those as well. Uh, looks like we got some San Pellegrino drinks over here and a Ren Ciata Rosa. I don't know if that's how you say it. And then some rice seasoning for sushi. There's a couple of these little Asian little noodle packs. I'm not even going to try to say that. We also have some Diet Dr. Pepper for my husband. The cherry flavor, I believe. And then two packs of water bottles there. There's also some, I got this one from Sam's, this uh, picnic pack here. It has two ketchup, a sweet relish because we're out of that, and some mustard there pretty good deal and then some ranch dressing and then some Hellman's mayonnaise the squeezable ones those are always easier for the kids and so forth we also got some pistachios the little snack pack because I've been snacking on those more than peanuts since my husband told me that those are healthier than the peanuts so I went ahead and picked that up I also got some of this maple and brown sugar oatmeal to give the kids another option for breakfast instead of cereal. So we did that. And then my husband picked up some more clam chowder um, from Sam's. We also got some more chili to have with Frito Pie and hot dogs on easy nights. Some macaroni and cheese, 18 pack for the kiddos. We also, looks like we got some Pringles, sour cream and onion, and pizza. Pringle flavor uh, chips there. And then I also got um, four packs of my Coke Zero there. So all together, all of this stuff was about $800. Hope you guys like the video. And I, I have other grocery hauls there. So if you guys wanna check those out and you haven't seen them, make sure you check those out. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, ring the bell so you can be notified each time I post a new video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.